Hello, I'm Jerry Fort, the beer review guy. We've got another PBR hard copy product. This is hazelnut flavor. 5% ABV. A malt beverage with natural and artificial flavors. Contains milk and hazelnut. <clears throat> this was another um, part of the box that was sent to me. Um, the uh, PBR uh, hard copy mix. The I mean, the uh, mixture of... Uh, hazelnut, mocha, the regular, and the salted caramel. I think it was. So there's four flavors in this box. <clears throat> it was sent to me by uh, Tyler and Janine um, from Wise Acres Farms. They used a uh, um, tipsy truck delivery um, company here in Tulsa. Right here in Tulsa. Um, have it have this stuff sent to me really nice came to my door um, with this stuff here and then um, Jeremy comes in with the mail today and it's a it's a it's a Christmas type card maybe not really considered Christmas just a nice greeting card from uh, Tyler and Janine and the family um, and they were on a trip she was saying let's see what does this say <clears throat> It says, what a great year at Wise Acres Farm. The kids are really enjoying school and making new friends. Sylvia, seven years old, continues to amaze us with her artwork. That's cool because I like doing art type stuff too. I like to draw. Um, I'm a painter. That's an art, right? <laughs> um, Violet, five, is crushing it with her reading skills. I like to read. Y'all need to check out my other channel at uh, um, uh, Jungle Jerry's Treehouse. That's my other channel I just started not too long ago where I'm gonna be doing all kinds of stuff and I kind of started off by reading some stories. Some may not be fit for some children. They're kind of weird and scary stories. So, But I am doing some children's type books and some books that are for all ages. So just gradually I'm doing that kind of stuff. It's just fun and I enjoy reading stories and being silly with it. And, and also the channel's gonna be just a big variety of stuff besides reviews. So if you guys wanna check that out, you might enjoy that. <coughs> um, so that's cool. Violet is, is getting good with her reading skills. The highlight of the summer was our camping trip to Maine where we attended Moxie Fest in Lisbon Falls. After watching an epic Moxie parade, we all got to taste some Moxie ice cream, and Tyler made the news when he nearly defeated, nearly defeated the ten-year reigning champion in a Moxie chugging contest. Um, Jeremy and I actually reviewed the Moxie elixir, which I think is like a soda pop. That was like three years ago, and um, I can't remember it. Three years ago, it's like. But I think we I think we liked it. I can't remember for sure. I didn't know they made an ice cream. That's interesting. <clears throat> but uh, this is a pretty neat um, a picture. Their faces are all in like classic classic form. Um, there, here they are here enjoying this Moxie Fest, Moxie. Uh, Parade or what was it? Yeah, Moxie Fest, yeah. Okay. So that's pretty cool. Thank you for sending this to me. Appreciate that. Looks like they had a good time. Okay. I'm going to re I'm going to review one of the uh, of the PBRs they sent me. Like I said, this is the hazelnut. I have not had these. I've only had the hard coffee in this. So I'm curious about what this is like. <clears throat> well, it's like a dark chocolate milk kind of appearance.
Looks good. Oh, wow. It has the coffee aroma, it has like that lactose milky kind of aroma. You get a little bit of a vanilla. The chocolate is kind of almost like a, like a, yeah, almost like a little bit of a dark chocolate going on in there. I think I'm getting the hazelnut a little bit there. Not like real strong on the aroma. It's there, it's there slightly though. I'm not getting the, I'm not getting the alcohol, it's only 5%. There's a lot of big aromas in here, so it's kind of hidden. Smells really good. Okay, let's see what we got. It's got like a medium body to it. Get uh, a little bit of a coffee bitterness on the back end. You get just a little bit of the alcohol. It's not very strong. <clears throat> um, vanilla. You get a little bit of a almost like a mocha kind of taste. I know I have a mocha in there too. Did I mention that when I was? I like I did. Um, <clears throat> the hazelnut is there slightly. It's not strong in here either. But that is is fine i'm not usually a, like a real big hazelnut fan i like it in nutella um i don't mind the creamer so much anymore i didn't used to be a big fan of it some years back but i don't mind it now yeah the hazelnut taste is there like i said slightly but it's not as strong as as what i would I would think it should be. It should be just a little bit stronger in this one. But I think if you guys find these, I think you'll enjoy it anyway, even though it's not big on the hazelnut. <clears throat> Brewed and packaged by 12s. 12.5 Beverage Company? Hmm. It's, it's 12, it, it says 12, not the number, but 12. And then at the end of the E, the five is connected right to it. I don't know if that's a mistake or if it's supposed to be that, like that 12, five beverage company, or if it's, and that's just how they did it, just to be unique, I guess, maybe. They, they did this for the Paps Brewing Company brewed and packaged it for them but hey um this is really good yeah i like it okay so there you go there's the hazelnut flavor <clears throat> well thank you tyler and janine for sending me this i got a couple more to do for you guys the original i done it i can't remember how many years ago it's been but i've done it a while back i'm going to do a revisit of it um so i got actually i got three more the original i still need to do the mocha and well maybe that is it since so i got this one done that was three okay so <clears throat> i got those to do um and, and Jeremy and I need to do the, the duck, duck fat um, trail mix here pretty soon. Hopefully, he's been, he has to work like a lot of uh, late nights, so, um, which makes it difficult to do reviews with him. But hopefully, we'll get that done before y'all uh, need to do your, your party, um, if you're going to do that this year. Um, I need to send you all a, me a message and ask you when, when you plan on doing that. So we kind of have a, a goal where we have a goal to try to make. So you'll have some videos to watch while you're having your party or whatever. Okay. Thank you guys for watching. I appreciate it. Thanks again to Tyler and Janine for the card and 
in this in these uh, great little beverage and snack gifts. I appreciate it very much. And we'll see you all on the next one. I wish you all a Merry Christmas. Bye.